Well, it's, uh, it's, it was about like usual, you know, uh, as you said. Uh, if I'd have had maybe, uh, there's 11 guys, that pretty good football players that didn't play a down today. I think 16 played one down, caught one pass. So, uh, you know, we got some guys that are standing on the sideline that, that could be starters, and, and so we need to get them back, get them well, get them back, and I think it will spruce things up a little bit. And, uh, you know, we, we still uh, making too many mistakes. I thought, you know, the quarterbacks did uh, admirably. Uh, you know, we, we got to make sure that we understand about taking care of the football. And, uh, and uh, you know, we've got to execute better. We've got to protect better. We've got to uh, run the football better. So, uh, so if we can, if we can, uh, if we can get to where we are, uh, low or no turnover offensive football team, we'll have a chance to beat anybody on our schedule. Otherwise, you know, it's just going to be tough. So, you know, we got to work hard on that and instill that in, in these guys. Uh, and uh, defensively, uh, looked like some plays were made. Uh, made some plays on the ball, which is good. And, uh, you know, we, we, uh, we feel like we're getting a little better, and hopefully that's, uh, that'll turn out to be true. Questions? So who's the starting quarterback for the fall? <laughs> <laughs> I really don't know. I, I, you know, I think the same, the same leaders that came in are leading coming out. Uh, you know, with uh, I thought, uh, I thought uh, Brandon had his moments, and uh, I thought uh, uh, Warren had his moments. Uh, uh, you know, so yeah, it's really. When, uh, when Reagan gets through grading it and, and, uh, and we sit down and ponder it, uh, I think we'll have an answer uh, to, to get who will get the most reps going in. You know? and, uh, excuse me, man, we're nowhere away from an opener against a really good team. And, uh, and uh, you know, new coaching staff and all that, a lot of new energy at UAB, so we gotta, we got to make sure we match it. See a scenario where you guys use two again with a change of pace? With very, very well could. Uh, you know, uh, I think, you know, it's been proven in a lot of places you can do that. I got a good friend in Montgomery that played one every two possessions, a different one every two possessions. So, and uh, they did pretty good with that. Uh, so, you know, uh, uh, it, it, I'm not, I'm, we're not going to copy anybody. We're going to try to be what we think we need to be to win games. And, and uh, if that's a one guy with a backup or if that's alternating, whatever it is, we'll try to do. I guess, you know, long time until fall camp starts. Just what's the most important thing for these guys from now until then? Well, number one would be uh, making sure you're eligible to be here next fall. And, uh, academics would be vitally important. We, we work harder in that than anything. Strength, condition, and, uh, you know, trying to improve yourself physically is also very important. Coach Shaughnessy shoulders that burden along with his staff. And, uh, you know, getting those 11 or 12 guys well that could be starters would be important too. So I think, you know, but the pri priority right now is, is a, a, a drive academically to the, to the finish and see what, see what we can do there. Thank y'all, appreciate it guys. Dontrell, just how did you think you played today in the offense as a whole? Um, I think we did some good things, you know, but there's always room to improve on everything, you know. But um, we did some good things coming out, and we got to finish towards the end. Where do you think you are at in this kind of quarterback competition, and what do you got to do going forward to try to win that job? <laughs> well, you know, I'll just be more consistent on the deep ball, you know, making good decisions for the team, you know, and be more consistent. That's all. About half and half on the deep ball, almost got a touchdown on one, and then have one picked off. What are your thoughts on yeah, I was kind of – the first one, you know, I felt pretty good about it because, you know, we have been working on it in practice and getting more air on it. So when I completed it, you know, I felt accomplished. But then again, I came back out and killed myself with an interception. But, you know, just get it on the outside and we'll, we'll be excellent. How hard is it to get a read with so many of the running backs and so many of the offensive line uh, out to get an understanding of what this offense can really be like? Stop. It's kind of hard, you know, because, you know, when you ain't got all the pieces to the puzzle, you don't see the whole picture. So, you know, when they all come back, you know, it'll be, we'll be able to tell where we are. It's done this spring, and how do you think y'all did today? Oh, uh, we've improved. I mean, we started, we started with, like I said, we started, we started small. I mean, you know, how, you know how it is. We first coming back, you got to get back in the rhythm of things. But as, as the spring went on, we did a lot better. I mean, 
like I said, we got experienced guys like Lonnie, Tyler, Billy Dobbs. You know, we all just working. We just we just got to keep getting better, better every day. That's what we're going to start. I like the way we finish, but uh, go, going into the summer, we're going to we work even harder and, and try to uh, get the uh, lead to something in Saxon. How much uh, the, uh, is there a burden on y'all to make sure there's not a drop off from what the offense, I mean, the defensive line did last year? To uh, this year? We got high expectations. I'm gonna say that much because I mean you got you got guys like Tony Gillespie and, and all those guys. They 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 put it in last year. I mean they, they set the standard. So I got our job as underclassmen is what we did last year to uh, keep building that same same uh, presence up. We want to go in there and let everybody know that we're the best D line in the Sun Belt. 